Greetings, greetings. Today's meditation is dedicated to the element of air. The interesting thing about air is we only sense it when it's in motion. And air in motion in Hebrew is ruach. Ruach also is a word that means spirit or consciousness, which is also constantly in motion. So I invite you to begin to connect to the energy of air, of a view and the energy of spirit and wind, of ruach, that are alive inside of you and all around you by closing your eyes and placing your hands over your beautiful heart. And to take note of the Ruach that is being blown in and out of you. As you breathe in every moment, with every neshima you can get a sense of your neshama with every breath you can become more in touch with your soul and choose to feel this breath moving in and out through your nose or your mouth. life is animating you through motion. Through shifts and changes. Is not still. As you slow down your breath and allow yourself to soften to the music, see if you can feel the air around you as it touches your skin. And see if you can allow your awareness to expand even further. to the air that surrounds you that isn't even touching your skin. <clears throat> it might seem invisible and empty.
but all of this seemingly empty space is filled with divine consciousness. It's filled with energy. Hashem's consciousness is willing you into existence in this moment. And this moment. In this moment. This is the Ruach Elohim Merachefet al Pnei Hamayim. The Spirit, the Wind of God, is hovering over the water. Vayomer Elohim Vayhi O And with that consciousness He's creating the light that you are Creating you anew in every moment And I invite you to imagine that you are yet again in Egypt, in Mitzrayim, living your past existence as a slave. And feel the Ruach Elohim that blows in plague after plague. Feel it against your cheek. Allow yourself to be in awe of the locusts. The darkness. you step out of Egypt and begin your journey in the desert, experience the power of the Ruach Elohim that splits the sea of reeds. and feel the walls of water on either side of you. And 
feel the dry land beneath your feet. And across this sea and feel the cool air against your skin in the hot desert. <clears throat> now stand on the other side of that sea and feel the Ruach Elohim bringing those walls back, crashing over Paro and his chariots and his soldiers. Now allow yourself to be transported in time into the land of Israel. As you stand on your nachala, on your inherited piece of land, And feel the Ruach cool against your skin. As you know, Mashiva Ruach or Morida Geshem, the spirit, the wind of God is what brings the blessing. So welcome that powerful wind with your arms wide open. Feel it rustling the trees. Feel it cooling your skin more and more. Feel it whispering cheek whispering blessings into your ears and kissing those blessings onto your cheeks. Now feel that rain that the wind brings and allow it to soak you from head to toe. and feel that rain soaking into the land. And feel the blessing of the land coming more and more to life. Shiva Ruach, Mori Geshem. The Spirit of God hovers over the waters. What kind of ruach, kind of consciousness? Do we want to blow onto the waters, onto the spaces of open potential in the land of Israel and the people of Israel? Perhaps we can follow Hashem's lead. And simply say 
vai rir ó oh. vai rir ó oh. vai rir ó oh. I invite you for a few moments to be like the spirit of God, the wind of God, and imagine yourself hovering over the land of Israel and the people of Israel. and open your hands and feel them hovering over the land and the people. And be saying the words of Anabekoach, which appear on the screen in front of you, or you can simply keep your eyes closed and feel the light of those words and of those letters, blessing the people in the land with an infinite divine light. Ana bekoach gedulat yemincha atir tzerura kabel rinat amcha sagvenu taharenu noa na gibor dorshe yechudcha kevavat shomren barchen taharen Rachmei Tzidkatcha Tamid Gomlen Chassin Kadosh Berov Tuvcha Nahel Adatecha Yachid Ge'e Le'amcha Pnei Zohrei Kedushatecha Shavateinu Kabel Ushma Tzaakateinu Yodea Ta'alumot Shem Kevod Manchuto Leolam Vaed. We're going to bless this land with even more light. I invite you. To feel the crown of your head opening up and to feel the Ruach Elokim making its way in through the crown of your head and filling your head with a radiant divine Yud. A yud so bright that it fills your entire head with its light. And you can feel that light beaming out of the pores of your face and smiling and shining upon the people of Israel. That the air around you should be filled with the light of love healing and feel the Ruach Elokim blowing in through the crown of your head, blowing a hay in you or through you till the top of the hay meets you between the shoulders and the legs of the hay fill your arms. with pure light. And there's more light than your shoulders and arms could possibly contain. So allow that extra light to shine out of the palms of your hands. And 
the ruach that shines out of your hands is so filled with light it lights up the entire land and people of Israel bless them with every abundance and the vav of Hashem's name Feel it being blown in with the Ruach Elokim into the crown of your head. And see it coming down until it slips right into your spine. And that light radiates from your spine, filling your entire torso. And shining out of your heart on to the people of Israel. Vayhi O. Shine your love, your compassion, your gratitude, your joy. So your face is shining and your hands are shining and your heart is shining. And they're sending out a ruach of light onto the people. And we have one last hey that you can feel a ruach Elohim blowing into the crown of your head. Feel it make its way down until the top of the hay meets you between the hips. And the legs of the hay fill your legs with radiant divine light. A light that grounds you into the earth. Even while your crown is open for divine light to keep flowing through you. And there's more light than your legs can hold, so feel the surplus beaming out of the bottoms of your feet and filling the land of Israel with its light. The light of all blessing and all abundance. The light of Malchut of a divine vision being actualized through the Jewish people. So feel your face beaming and your hands beaming and your heart beaming and the bottoms of your feet beaming and feel a great beautiful wind of light and of love shining out of all of you every pore in your body is radiating out to the entirety of the Jewish people to Bnei Israel and Eretz Israel and Dinat Israel they should all feel their divinity that every time a ruach kisses their cheek they should feel that it is a divine kiss of love that every moment they breathe They should feel that it is a Ruach Elohim making its way into their body and whispering to them, Vayahi O. I invite you now to bring those beautiful hands of yours back to your precious heart. 
and all of that light and blessing you've been giving to the people. Shine it upon yourself as well. Love yourself. Bless yourself. Forgive yourself. You are the love you've always been waiting for. You can choose to be the Ruach Elohim in your life that whispers to yourself. Let there be light. Thank you for joining us here. Whether it's in the live meditation or in a future now via the recording. Thank you for bringing us your light. For shining that light onto the Jewish people. And for being a source of blessing for the entire world. When you're ready, I invite you to wiggle your fingers and wiggle your toes. And you can bat your eyes open. And come back to a new body in a new world filled with so much more light because you're in it. Sending you blessings from South Africa.